Hello guys, in this video, I am going to show you the working of IC4011. So let's get started. This one is IC4011. It is NAND GET IC, CMOS IC. It has 14 pins. Pin number 7 is ground and pin number 14 is plus VCC. We can apply plus 3 volt to plus 15 volt. So this can be a power supply. Now it has 4 NAND gate. It is NAND gate 1. Here it is input 1 input 2 and this is the output 1 here another get this pin number 4 is output pin number 5 is input 1 and this is input 2 it is gate number 1 gate number 2 here then get 3 this is gate number 4 so these are all 4 then get in the breadboard we will see only gate number 1 Now we will see the connection in the breadboard. This is gate number 1. So its output will be pin number 3. And both the inputs are pin number 1 and pin number 2. To provide input to the gate, we have to use the push button switch or any kind of switch. And in the other side of the switch, here it is high signal. I will connect plus 5 volt as high signal. So as a power supply, I will use VCC as plus 5 volt and ground. It is obviously it is ground. And with the output, we have to connect a resistor and then an LED to see the output. Negative pin is connected to the ground. And with the input, we also connect LEDs to see the input and the value of the resistor is 220 ohms. Theoretically connection is completed but in practical we have to use pull down resistor with the input and I will connect 10 kilo ohms as pull down resistor and these resistor are compulsory with the logic gates and I already explained about this resistor link in the description below and its truth table is here this one is input A and input B and Y is output so input A and B and here it is Y when both the inputs are 0 our output will be 1 but 1 0 output will be 1 0 1 output will be 1 when both the inputs are 1, then only our output will be 0. And we can write y equal to a dot b inverse. So this is the truth table. Now we will verify this in breadboard. This is the IC4011 and I am putting it here. This is input A, input B. Pin number 7 is connected with ground. Pin number 14 is connected with positive rail. One pin of the switch is connected to the positive rail and other pin is connected to the input. This A is connected to input 1 and this input is connected to input 2 that is input B. Positive pin is connected with the switch and other pin that is the negative pin is connected with negative rail. With the input pin, pull down resistors are connected. It is 10 kilo ohms resistor. Pin number 3 is output. And I am connecting it here. With this, positive pin of the LED is connected. And negative pin of the LED is connected with resistor. And then it is connected to negative rail. Positive and negative rails are connected together. 
So this is how we have completed the breadboard connection. Now we'll see the output. I'm connecting 5 volt power supply. Here it is negative. And this is the positive. According to the truth table, when both A and B are 0, then we should get the output. We are getting the output. When A1, B0, we should get the output. A0, B1, we should get the output. And when both A and B are 1, then our output should be 0, according to the truth table. So this is how we have verified the truth table of NAND gate IC4011. So this is the working of IC4011. Thanks for watching.